North Korean soldiers boarded this airliner and blindfolded everybody. But why? In 1969, only 10 minutes after a Korean Air YS-11 had taken off in Seoul, a passenger got up and entered the cockpit. It's speculated that he hijacked the plane or conspired with one of the pilots in doing so. But either way, the plane then started heading towards North Korea. When it arrived at Sondok Airfield at 1.18 p.m., the landing was so rough that it damaged the plane beyond repair. North Korean soldiers then boarded the plane, blindfolded everybody, and led them out. While in captivity, the 46 passengers were subject to indoctrination for up to four hours each day. And a staggering 66 days later, in February of the next year, North Korea released 39 of the passengers, but the crew and the remaining passengers were held in North Korea. North Korean officials claimed that they stayed by their own choice and that they're unharmed, but clearly there's a lot of reason to be skeptical of that. Which crazy story should I cover next?